In this short video, I will show you how to search the Colorado House and Senate Journal's digital collection sponsored by the University of Colorado Law Library. Our starting point will be this session law that was enacted in 1976 on page 314 of the session law volumes for that year. Looking up that session law and the session law volumes, we see that it was based on House Bill number 1137. At this point, we will now go and locate where the bill is discussed in the House Journal. At this point, let's now find that session law in the Colorado House and Senate Journal's digital collection. If you are not already on the digital collections website, you can get there from the Wall Library website. This is our default homepage, and here is our search box. And our digital collections are linked under this heading digital collections and we want the second entry house and senate journals we have two ways in order to find the entries in the house and senate journals one way is simply to treat the house and senate journals as we would a print text and look it up in the book so our legislation is based on house bill 1137 from 1976 we can choose the year from the year drop down menu 1976 and then we can choose that we want to look at the House of Representatives journal. And with that, we can click on search. And we actually have two entries for that year. In 1976, there was both a regular session of the General Assembly plus an extraordinary session of the General Assembly. We're looking for entries in the regular session. We click on the title. It will then load a PDF version of the House journal as it appeared in print. So you can see here is our PDF viewer and it looks like a big print volume. These left and right arrow buttons are next page and previous page buttons. We can click on next page and we can scroll through the house journal as if we were looking at it in print. If we click on this button here, show full screen, it'll bring us to a larger version of document you can even click on the zoom in feature to make it larger still. We also have the capability of searching inside this book. We can look for a keyword or we can enter in the bill number, which in this case happens to be 1137 and click search. And if you notice now we have all these little balloons that drop down onto places in the house journal where the search term 1137 appears. So for this particular search, we'll both get entries for House Bill 1137, but also any occurrence where the term 1137 appears, that can also mean page number. But if we click on the bubbles, the little balloons, we can see where our entries begin. Here is a committee on reference. Let's go ahead and make that larger. And we can see this is House, the Committee on Judiciary recommends that House Bill number 1137 be amended. And here is the committee's report. And we can flip to the next page if we want to, to see the rest of the report. So that is one approach in order to find entries where the House Bill appears in the House Journal. But there is another solution to this problem. We can actually start from <clears throat> the session law itself. So we're gonna go back to our digital archive. And this time we're going to look for the session law itself. And we were in 1976. So if you were starting here, this would maybe be a faster way to get there. And that was on page 314, 314. And we click on search. And here's the entry for that year. And here is the act itself. And here again is a PDF viewer of the document. This is a little slow to load, but it will, it will load. If we scroll to the bottom of the entry, we see this details drop down menu where we see the information we saw before in terms of it. This act started on page 294, it's chapter 34. But we also see these two entries, bill and house and bill and senate. So if you want to see where in the House Journal this bill is discussed, you simply need to click on this link and it will open to the House Journal and it'll look for occurrences where that bill appeared using the bill number 
plus a little bit more sophisticated search term. So we're likely to get fewer uh, false positives. Each of these entries should in fact represent where House Bill 1137 is discussed. So here is one entry where it's introduced and here's the second entry on page 406. This is what we looked at before. This is reports of committee and reference and you can see there are other entries for House Bill 1137. So there you have it. There are two different ways in which you can look up a session law in the House and Senate journals. If you have any additional questions, please let us know in the law library. Thank you.